So I'm going to go down to Burns Beach. The time is currently 4.35. The sun sets I think at 6. I'm going to get down there uh, for about 5 and then meet up with my friend Nick. And we're going to try to get some photos of the sunset. Um, <clears throat> I'd normally bring the intervalometer for long exposures, but now with the D750, I can just do a time setting. Let's go manual. I think it's this one. I just click and then I just time the exposure and then I just end it by clicking it again. You might get a bit of blur, but if it's over like five minutes clicking it won't really matter. All good. Um, I prefer to use a backpack when I'm taking photos just because it's easier to keep on me. I don't need to leave it um, behind uh, my back on the beach where I don't know it could get stolen. So backpack, cam, and don't forget the base plate. We have currently arrived. Let's just zoom in over here. Look at these beautiful clouds. What's happening here? Oh, there we go. Oh, hung. That's great. Back to this better. We're gonna pop this on the tripod. Wait for Nick. Nick's here. Oh, I forgot the mirror. It's all right. Let's go down there and shoot. Now I don't know if this is gonna sound windy but I'm trying to block it. This is what Burns Beach looks like from above. The clouds are great tonight. Yep. And these are the rocks that are, if you ever look at my sea or ocean photos, seascapes or what they're called, um, these three rocks are always on the horizon because it's the only beach I, I go to. Yep, all set. Just waiting for Nick. So this is the beautiful colour in the sky at the moment. There's Nick. I'm just over there. Hello. Look at this. Just sitting there. Beautiful colour in the sky. Love it. Now this is the current composition. We're going backwards to the to the east. There's a big wave coming. Setting. So I'll just try to show you what we're going for. Is this, is that curve there up to the sky? Now to 
put the camera away because it's just a bit too hectic. But we'll go home and we'll edit these photos. This is the kind of shot I'm getting out of the camera as well. Just go through a few of these. It's a bit dark. Sorry, I'm just trying to get the reflection right. Good shots in So this is the first photo, um, it's just a bit dark, there's detail here, but it's just, this is being blown out, almost, so we have to capture the detail here, and bring this back a bit, and lighten this up, and get rid of this tripod leg from this photo. So. I did that with a few adjustments. Let's go. So this is just through Lightroom doing all those changes. You can see there's a lot more detail here and the color is a lot nicer around this. Um, and then you got this line here taking you around the image. Um, I prefer to get rid of this stuff as well in Photoshop. So, if we just go next, this is the final product. So, I've added a bit more light in here. Um, because the sun's coming from over here, it's hitting these parts of this hill, the sand, sand hills, more prominently than like parts here and maybe the shadow area here and rocky areas here. Uh, you can see Nick's head here, but we'll get rid of that, um, and the legs being removed as well. So yeah, that's the final image. Um, hope you enjoyed.